Yes, we've been awarded with a beautiful, beautiful scene of not one, not two, but actually three wonderful big male lions. Now, I'm guessing that this could be Fang and his coalition, but I'm not entirely certain just yet. Fang is missing a tooth, hence the name, but haven't seen any of them yawn yet and haven't spent a great deal of time with this coalition. They usually actually spend time, if it is them, in an area where I usually try and avoid because we're not allowed to off-road there. But thankfully, they've come up close to the escarpment. And I'm guessing they could have possibly made a kill and or stolen a kill from the Sausage Tree Pride, who were very close to this area last night. There's no sign of them this morning. But the one male lion here does look to be well fed. And we actually saw two of them. I'm pretty sure th two of these three last night moving their, making their way into this area. So they've obviously met up with the third member of their party. As you can see now, they are fast asleep and snoozing. Not giving us the best view, sadly. Hopefully, they'll pick up their heads at one point. The male that's closest to us has got a beautiful dark mane. You can see the comparison between the one in the back there. We spotted them from, I would say, possibly a mile away. <laughs> but it was a far, a far easier job because they all had their heads up looking very intently. And it was a wonderful scene to just see these big lion manes from that far away. Having to search, following track for track of the leopard he's looking for. And I'm hoping he gets lucky soon. It's far easier here in the Mara to spot things. Hi, Joseph. You'd like to know when do lions hunt? Well, it's definitely, you know, a, a general trend is that they move more at night than during the day. And when they're moving, they kind of increase their likelihood of coming across animals to hunt. So even though they may be just going for a walk, looking for ladies, making sure their territory is well looked after, they could bump into an opportunity and take it at any given time. Even now, even though they're fast asleep, if a herd of buffalo was to wander onto the scene, they could well have a go at them. So there's no set rules, but as a general kind of trend, they are more active at night but it's certainly not to say that it's a set rule that they will only hunt at night they will hunt at any stage of the day that an opportunity presents itself to them Just scanning down in the plains below us quickly, I can see two giraffe that are standing very still, staring very intently in a certain direction. And they are great indicators to help us find predators. There's not to say there's one that could just be relaxing there, chewing the cud. Or maybe they can see something. Or whatever has stopped them, and if they are in fact looking at something, I can't for now work out what I'm going to be a cheater when I didn't see any lion initially because it is so open, it would be quite easy to see lion from here. But the fact that we can't see anything, maybe it's a leopard or a cheetah, that would be a very pleasant surprise. Wonderful. We are going to spend a few more minutes with these boys in the hope that they lift up their heads so we can show you how pretty they are. And while we do that, we are going to be sending you off to Tristan.